Well, Adam, thank you. The Marion County Health Department is calling on hospitals to reinstate visitor restrictions to help curb the spread of viruses. News 8 Danielle Zukowski spoke with healthcare leaders across the region to learn more. She joins us live outside of Methodist Hospital to explain what's happening. Danielle. Yes, well, hospitals in the Indianapolis area are instating visitor restrictions. Now, this is to help curb the spread of things like RSV, the flu, COVID. Some of the experts I talked to say this is standard practice at this time of year, and some of the hospitals in the area have been doing this for at least a decade. The visitor restrictions include no one over the age of 18 allowed in as a guest, no one allowed in with a fever, cough, headache, muscle and joint pains, sore throat, or a runny nose, and in most cases, only two people are allowed in as visitors at a time. This is something we've actually done for years when flu and uh, RSV roll around. Of course, COVID's added a little uh, a little bit of a wrinkle because it's just a third disease instead of the two we've dealt with every winter for decades. The Marion County Health Department says these restrictions will be similar across Ascension St. Vincent, Community Health Network, IU Health, Franciscan Health, and Eskenazi Hospital. In the past, somewhat confusion, one hospital saying one thing and another hospital having uh, different things, but this is the most effective from an infection control standpoint of having all the recommendations to the public where we're all uh, united. Ultimately, experts say these restrictions are to protect vulnerable hospital patients and slow the spread of these diseases. So our immune system is already uh, low and some of them are immunocompromised. And so they're, it's much more easy for them to catch other illnesses. Franciscan Health is also asking anyone visiting someone with a respiratory illness to mask while in the building. While these restrictions are similar across the major hospitals in the Indianapolis metropolitan area, you should check with the individual hospital you plan to visit to make sure you're in compliance with their specific regulations. I'm Danielle Zulkowski for Wish TV, wishtv.com, and like us on Facebook.